Hello, hello, hello. I'm Tara. We're going to do another Tara's Tries here. And I want to try to make some of those roses out of leaves that you've seen on Facebook and Pinterest. Let's see if it's doable or if I'm able to do it. So I'm following this video on my um, computer. Let's see if I can follow along with it and see how it goes. I'll put these white pieces of paper down maybe to be able to see it a little better. So let's start off and see what happens. Okay, so it says fold a maple leaf. I'm not sure what a maple leaf is. But in half, horizontally. Like, we well, um, that didn't work. Let's try another leaf. Maybe that one was just too dry. Set that over here. Um, it says a little leaf. Let's try this one. I try to get different colors and sizes, you know, just to see what would work best. But I think they're all a little too crumbly. So, well, there's one good thing though. I do live in the country. So let me make a quick run to my yard. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I got the leaves. Let's take these out and just See, they're so pretty. But these are all dried up. So it's windy and it's got a bit of a cold breeze out there, just like fall weather. And of course, you didn't go out without a jacket. But hey, we got us some more leaves. I don't know what a maple leaf looks like. The video I'm watching says maple leaf. I got a bunch of random leaves some small, some big, some red. Some itty bitty itty bitty red ones. It's got some red paint on it. That paper does. Not the leaves. But see, look. I thought these were too cute. Now I don't know what they go to. Now I'm sure I can't use it for this. But I thought they were just too cute. I love the fall, you all. But here we go. Let's get us a maple leaf. And I have no idea what a maple leaf is. Um, I've got all kinds of different sizes and shapes and colors. Got a couple of these big yellow ones. Kind of looks somewhat similar to what she has. Kind of, I think is one of these, but I didn't see one that was as big. Here's one. So she said to fold it in half. There we go. Oh, we've got a helper here helping us. Hello, Evie. Come on, you can't be in the picture. Move, no, cat. Maybe this is why I don't do crafts much. Too many animals. Oh, we get another leaf. We'll and then fold it over. And put this thing inside this one. And roll it like this. There we go. So far, so good. Continue watching. So repeat it. She did it again with another one. Let's get some green on here. I guess we'll go this side, right? I sure would like to have a little bit of that red, but I don't have all the big red ones. I'm looking like a rose to me, but. until we get a nice big size. What, what considers a nice big size? I, I don't know. Let me watch some more of the video. I did two more leaves. I got all kinds of funky limbs though. Stems. It's falling apart. When you're rolling the leaves together, make sure that you secure the bottom with your hands snugly oh. so that way they don't unravel. Oh, well, that's what we have so far. Um, now we're going to put the apple pie. When you're putting the outer petals, you don't need to fold these. You just go to wrap it around. Oh, just wrapping it around. I think I'm using too small. I prefer to use the bigger leaves on the outer petals. I'm going to go ahead and see. This thing's crazy. Well, hmm, what do you all think? Um, I'm thinking I probably it, 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 it's somewhat of a rose. Well, there is my attempt for a rose, you all. <laughs> there you go folks there's my rose ish type thing um i hope you had fun and enjoy it i did enjoy it 
and I'm sure that if we were to try it again it'd get a lot better just takes practice to learn and there are a lot of great other tutorials on the site that you can go through and look at and thank you for joining me y'all stay safe out there bye now